everybody today we're going to draw Sheriff Shadrach's sheep so in his story he went to shell town with his sheep to protect everybody and make sure that everybody is sharing so we will draw his sheep today so make sure you have a piece of blank paper ready and a pencil and let's draw a sheep we're going to make the head kind of small on uh, the left side of our paper here oops and we're going to leave some space because we're going to make the whole body of the sheep on this side and we have lots of labels to do today so I'm going to try to make some room so that I can have enough room for all of my balloons okay let's make two eyeballs so two circles and we're going to add a circle inside our circle. Okay, so that's our two eyeballs. Next, we're going to draw two little nostrils. So two circles for the nose. And then on the side of the eyeball here, on this eyeball, I'm going to draw a line down. And I'm going to swoop up and go to the middle in between the nostrils. I'm going to try to make it not so blurry. Oops getting brighter outside okay let me fix it there you go okay so I'm going to do the same thing for the other side of the eye I mean on the other eyeball I'm going to draw a line down and swoop up and connect it to the middle okay once you have your um, nose done you're going to draw a little mouth like that And now we're going to draw the ears. So next to your eyes, so not touching the eye, leave a little space and draw a little curve, like a little rainbow shape almost. And do an upside down rainbow and connect it. And there's one ear. We're gonna make another one on the other side. So rainbow shape next to our eyeball and upside down rainbow and close it so we have two ears now we have to make the face so right um, on the end of our ear here you're going to draw a line and connect it all the way to the side of the nose on the bottom like that. Do the same thing for the other side. So come to the um, edge of the ear here and connect it to the other side of the nose. Okay, now we're going to make the top of the head and we're going to make a fluffy top for our sheep. So we're going to make almost like a cloud because sheep are very fluffy like that. And then same thing for the top, make it fluffy and connect it to the ear. So we have our sheep head now. Now we're going to make a fluffy body for our sheep we're going to come to like where the ear is just on top of it here you're going to make a fluffy line like that and then you're going to start going down i'm probably not going to have room for my balloons but we'll see okay fluffy on the bottom 
and then fluffy all the way up to the other ear. So we got a fluffy, fluffy sheep. Okay, we're missing some legs. So let's do the legs on the bottom. How many legs do sheep have? Do they have two legs or do they have four legs? If you think four legs, you are right. So we're going to draw four legs for a sheep. We're gonna make two in the front and two in the back to make four. So in the front, I'm gonna draw a line down and another line down next to it like that. And I'm going to close it on the bottom. So look at how our leg is not just a stick leg. It's going to be a thick leg. Okay, so on the other side of this, we're going to draw another leg. So two lines and connect it. So we have two. How many more do we need? We need two more on the back. One line, two line, connect it. One line, two lines, and connect it. So now we have four legs. One, two, three, four. Four legs. Okay, I'm going to add a fluffy tail to our back of our sheep. And I will add one detail. Actually, I'm going to add two details to my picture to make our sheep look more realistic. So the first thing is I'm going to add hooves to the bottom of our legs here. So I will make a line across on the bottom and a line down. So like a little tiny T for the hoof. And then another T. And the same thing for the back. T and T. So those are our hooves. And I'm gonna make some swirls on the body of our sheep because that's going to be the fluffy wool. Just a few of them on the body like that. And that is our sheep. So I'm going to label sheep now. Sh sheep. What does sh sheep start with? Sh well, that sounds like shaving. So that means it's Sheriff Shadrach sound, S-H, shh. So I'm gonna make an S-H for my label. Um, I guess I will write it on the bottom, S-H. Okay, sh-eep, sh-eep, e. Hmm, what sound is that? E. E. That is leaping Eve. So that's two E's. E. E. So sh e p. Sh e p. 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 Sheep. Balloon it. And because we're going to label other parts of the sheep, I'm going to make um, a double balloon here because that's the whole picture is a sheep. So I'm going to do two a uh, bo double balloon, tie it to our sheep. Okay, other thing we're going to label today is the hoof. So hoof. Hoof starts with hippy hippo sound H. Huh, oh, 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 oh. That is Woody Woodchuck, two O's. Hoof, 
Puff. F for Farley Fox. Hoof. Okay, I'm going to draw a balloon. I'm not going to do a double balloon because um, the hoof is only a part of the picture, not the whole picture. So tie your single balloon to the hoof. Okay, other thing we're going to label today is the wool. W -w wool. W -w -w. So washing your face. W -w -w. Winky walruses sound. So that is a W. 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 Wool. Double O and L. Balloon it, and you're going to pick one of these swirls here because that's our wool, and you're going to tie it to the wool. Okay? Now, here is the hard part. You're going to think of a word that describes the sheep. So, it can be a fluffy sheep, it can be a scary sheep, it can be a cute sheep, it can be a happy sheep, it can be whatever kind of sheep you want. So think of a word to describe the sheep. Did you think of a word? Okay, so if you have a word, you're going to label it next to the word sheep now. So what kind of sheep is your sheep going to be? Mine is going to be a fluffy sheep. So I will write the word fluffy next to the word sheep. So fluffy starts with an f. f. So I'm going to write fluffy. When you do it, you're just going to do your kid writing. So whatever you hear, you're just going to write it your way, okay? It's just kid writing. So, full, uh, uh, I think I hear a U. Fluff, oh, I have, I think there's another F. Fluff E. There's a Y at the end. Okay, so I'm not going to, um, I'm not going to balloon it because this is just a word to describe sheep. So I'm just going to draw a little tiny arrow and point it to the balloon. So it's fluffy sheep. Now I'm going to do the same thing for hoof. So for the hoof, I'm going to think, hmm, what kind of hoof is it going to be? So how can I describe my hoof? Is it going to be a hard hoof? Or is it going to be a squishy hoof? Is it going to be a brown hoof? Is it going to be a loud hoof? I don't know. Hmm, I'm gonna think, what do I want it to be? I think I'm going to make it a hard hoof. So I'm gonna write the word hard. Um, I guess I'm gonna write it up here because I don't have room. <sighs> H ha, R R Oh, that's Arnie Erdvark A R Hard D Daisy Dragon D So I'm not going to balloon it. I'm just going to draw an arrow pointing to the hoof. So now it says hard hoof. Okay, last one is my wool. I have to think about how to describe the wool. So is it going to be soft wool? Is it silky wool? Is it itchy wool? Or is it swirly wool? So think of a word to describe the wool on your sheep. I'm going to, I'm going to make it itchy wool. So eh, eh, eh. I for our Ichabod Ichthyosaurus. It, t, t, Timmy Tiger. It, ch, 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 ch. Chauncey Chipmunk, C H. 
Itchy, e e e. Leaping Eve. It ends with a y. Sorry, it's kind of messy. I have lots of words on my board here. I'm not going to balloon it. Just a little arrow and point it to the word wool. So it says, itchy wool. So how many words do I have on my board? Let's see. I have one. Two, three, four, five, six. So I have six words on my board. Okay, so I have three balloons and I have three that are not in balloons. So that makes six words. When you do your sheep, I want to see you have six words on your paper. Okay, so I want you to label the wool. I want you to label sheep and hoof. And I want you to have three words to describe those things. So you have to describe your sheep and you have to describe the wool and describe the hoof, okay? So that's all for today. Um, after you're done labeling, you can color your sheep. Okay? I'm excited to see all of your drawings, and I will talk to you next time. Bye!